And then play the tutorial. As you would know in my old one, I jumped straight in the game. This is actually a brand new Notrium universe. I recently found out that there's a new version of the game, which is quite scary to be perfectly honest. Just let me activate my PowerPoint, just in case the game's a little laggy. And okay, go to the... Whoa, that looks like a door. Okay, right click on the door? Whoa, that is new. That is new. You found a flashlight. The flashlight requires battery energy to function and gets weaker when your battery runs out. You can turn flashlight off with the F key. Okay. That doesn't seem that old. Door. Door. He will learn to forage for food from various sources. The amount of food you can currently have present by should run out. Okay. See, this is what I was trying to make in my old Let's Play, so... Oh, yeah. Whoa. That's my guy. Now... Ethers. Now if I use... There we go. Num. And these are just edible fungus. Okay, here we learn about health. So to measure the red bar. Yep. Sorry if I'm seeing a little distracted. I'm also trying to recruit a new member for our podcast team. Yes, I know how all this works. These are... Whatever the hell they're called. That's a... Nation, so you drop and... Yep. And charge my batteries. Here we go, building something. Another skill I already... Much possess. I don't care how long this episode goes for. This is just an episode showing me the new world of Notrium, which is scary. Use. It takes a slot. I can only use certain items. It's a. That's a little dumb compared to the old one, which I could use anything. Okay, looks like I've entered a new area, which is very, very cold. Yep, so. It's a piece of firewood. I know all this already. Moving on. Oh, cool, a combat field. Okay. Um. Yep, and... Yes. Inventory. Nope. Oh, come off it. I'll try to do this as fast as possible. While not trying to look like an idiot. Use. And of course my laser pistol is now equipped as a weapon. Over here we have some med packs. Okay, who am I fighting? Whoa. That's a big alien. Congratulations, you completed the training. Sweet. Now there's apparently another tutorial, which is the Prostonic. Here we go. Welcome to the Prostonic tutorial, sir. Assume you are already familiar with the gameplay of Notrium and have played some of the other races before. The purpose of the tutorial is to familiarize you with new abilities and disadvantage of playing this with races. This race. As a Prostonic, you will require very little food and regenerate your energy slowly. However, you are very fragile enemy attacks, and the weather will not and the weather and will not be able to carry as any not be able to carry any items. The following section of the tutorial introduces you to the abilities of the Protonic. I shall teach you how to use your mental powers and how to unlock your abilities. <laughs> teach me all great master to begin your training. Step on the pedestal in front of you. You mean the giant thing? Step in on the giant thing. You will begin your game, mass, heat, emo, motion tokens, each symbol is specifically, 
special abilities to following the vases in instruction. Okay? You can practice three kinds of basic abilities you know. Just follow the path and wait at the other side. The mass token will allow you to store some of your life energy for later by using near healing plants because you are bound to injure yourself during travels you are a good idea to always have some of your life essence stored for emergencies and some of your later powers to store life energy step near a healing plant open your inventory and use mass token 20 for your life points will store and be ready to use at the question of this race seems mass token use okay no wait use life essence using the heal token brings you warm during cold weather okay so heat token Use, you feel a surge of heat. The motion token works like a radar to detect living creatures. Using it will show you where creatures are in the map. Can anyone see a movement? Ah. Motion token, use. Okay. This race is quite confusing. You'll mark a weapon with the combined with the free tokens. But you should rely on stealth if you wish to survive. Fight only at last resort. And wait until you unlock it. Now, move to the next area. Hooray! The tokens which you possess can be combined to obtain several different abilities. It's up to you to figure out the main combination possible. Remember, recover the combination tokens by pressing B. The free tokens which you are now enough to survive dangerous lands. You will need to explore deep into your mind to unlock your powers. In order to do this, you need to combine your tokens into precision. To combine, hear the motion tokens and use the result close toward it. Hit the dream land. Okay? Heat and focus token. Use. Use focus token. Pick up liquid to end this tutorial. Expect to face many challenges when you enter Dreamscape. You will not be able to leave until you obtain a new token. So before you enter, remember to bring life essence in full energy bar. I picked it up. Have to drop it? Drop. It just did say I could end the tutorial, right? Oh, now use the item to end the tutorial. Congratulations, you complete your training. Okay, so that'll be it for today's episode.